what's up guys it's me Chia. and in this episode we're going to talk about the samsung galaxy s8 um is it worth it going to 2022 because um the display is really nice um 2960 by 1440 and the specs are it's an exynos 8895 or you can go for the snapdragon 835 uh since it's a bit faster uh i love the amoled display the curved edges and um yeah and the pixels are just okay yeah so the cameras are actually nice i'm actually shooting shoot, shooting this video on 4k 30 on the phone uh the overlays are done by the m21 uh but if you can see the quality is just okay it's pretty nice from a phone from 2017 so um the cameras are okay you can take uh nice low light photos and actually get um pretty nice photos it has a lot of features on the camera and the fingerprint sensor is a bit hard to get actually you have to grip the phone well sometimes it's hard to get like when you get the phone for the first time you'll have to get used to it um using it uh with two hands to actually try and unlock the phone but after some time it will actually be easier and um it won't be a struggle to actually put the phone on so yeah you can actually uh biometrically um unlock the phone by um the iris scanner of face unlock okay i'd use face unlock but fingerprint sensor is is just okay for me uh yeah so the screen can get uh really bright and Okay, I love it when um, you're, you're actually using your phone and it's bright. It's pretty nice. And um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Um, you can upgrade it up to Android 9.0 uh, going to 2022 uh, from 7.0. Um, it's an Android uh, One UI, so it's pretty nice. 9.0 isn't that bad because um, it already has like its own uh, Samsung OS inside so it feels pretty good um it has expandable storage uh, it's 64 gb for the s8 not the s8 plus and yeah it's ip68 uh water resistance and dust resistance so i'd say the phone is a pretty good phone going to 2022 because you can really enjoy using it battery life um it's 3000 milliamps million per hour per battery so it's not okay it's just okay because it charges really fast so if you're going to work um as a daily driver going the whole day with it it's just okay because you put it in the charge an hour uh it's a hundred percent 30 minutes 50 so um going for work um it'll just be a nice uh phone overall so yeah that's the phone um that's pretty much it display is just okay i love the display and um bixby i i'm not sure about Bix. i don't like bixby that's uh my opinion because um you can use google assistant so thank you for watching this episode um it was a short one i guess and i'll talk to you guys in the next one